Hey there, Social Blade fans. Dave here for another Social Blade YouTube tip. And today we're going to be looking into a question that somebody asked me, uh, CPL Bruno on Twitter. Go follow him. I'll post his at in the description of this video. But anyway, he asks, how do you live stream to Twitch and YouTube simultaneously? So at the same time, you want to stream to two different sources. However, the limitation is usually that Twitch only allows you to use one camera at a time. So unless you have two cameras plugged in, you're really kind of can't do that so we have to use third-party software so we got twitch open we've got youtube we're on the upload page where we're going to start a google plus hangout we're going to use this as our master source and we're going to screen cap that send the screen cap over to a software and there's multiple different ones i'm going to show you x split but uh, you can also use a free software that a lot of people are happy with called obs or open broadcaster software it's at obsproject.com. I'll include a link in the description as well. Free software. It's great. It does work. I've never worked with it, so I'm not going to show you how to work with that because I don't know how to work with it. Uh, but I do know this great program called XSplit Broadcaster. It's not free, but it is a great program. And so we're logged in, and we're going to show you how to set this up. The first thing to do is you probably want to work with two monitors because for whatever reason, XSplit doesn't allow you to shrink this massive window that they give you. It's sort of always takes up a lot of monitor space and you need uh, a lot of desktop space in order to do this little trick so we're going to place this on my left monitor here i'm actually running a few monitors uh, unfortunately i'm only going to record the center monitor here but uh, be aware that we have things going on on two monitors so i'll try to explain this so let's start a google plus hangout go to the upload section go to hangouts on air hit broadcast it'll start up it'll ask you what do you want to title it so we'll do that once it loads the page So, social blade test hangout underscore live. Why not? Um, so, we're not going to invite anyone at this point, but um, we're just going to do this as uh, as itself. And the reason why I like starting with this program is because when you have multiple people, they show up as a list of people here. So, you could select who you want to be on camera. Whoever's highlighted in blue will actually be on this main big screen. So, you have the ability to do some manual uh, camera selecting. Uh, between multiple different things so I could join in with a laptop and have the screen grab or something like that And so I like the ability to switch cameras live like that. So now what we want to do is actually take this big screen here And we're going to take a screen grab of it using this program called XSplit So I'm gonna move it off screen here and there's a command line that says add screen region So we're gonna do that. We're gonna select most of this window here sort of keep it a 69 aspect ratio and if you sort of look over here, it's kind of awkward and off screen, but this is the Google Plus Hangout, which has been added. I'll actually shrink that down and sort of center it up. Now, what if we want to add another device? I'm going to go about covering this up for a second. So you sort of see some weird things going on. Uh, but what if we want to add another device such as, I don't know, I got a quadcopter with a live video link hooked up. So got that over there. Wave my hand in front of that camera back there. And so we have two different sources now. And so this is the ability to actually stream multiple different things to one source. Now, how do we stream all of this to twitch.tv? Well, on XSplit, it's quite fast and easy. You just simply go to broadcast and you could live stream to Justin or Twitch or the same thing in the end. And you hit this button, it'll actually connect to your account fairly easily if you set that up earlier. And you'll be able to uh, show people what is on the Google Plus Hangout or anything that you've set up in XSplit Broadcast or, or OBS. So I hope this helps you, CPL Bruno on Twitter. Thank you for suggesting this topic on uh, what to do and how to set up multi uh, broadcast for multiple different sites at once. Guys, if you have any questions, this can be a little bit confusing. Leave comments below. We like to answer those. Social Blade is always about community. And uh, if you guys have any other suggestions for topics, well, feed those below as well. I'll also include a link in the description below to our forum post on how to further get us uh, different topics and such for future site suggestions. We will feature your Twitter post, your Google Plus post, whatever it is, many of the social media websites in the videos that we do. So if you guys have any thoughts on videos that we may be able to do, let me know. I'd love to feature you guys. 
It's all about community when it comes to Social Blade. Hey, if you guys haven't done so already, hit the uh, thumbs up button. Let me know that you've liked this video. Hit the subscribe button so you're sure not to miss any future content uploads. And if you haven't done so already, head on over to socialblade.com to check your stats and other people's stats and as well as Twitch stats because, hey, Twitch, it's here. It's live. we got a bunch of different things. And as always, guys, I hope you like this video. If you do, let me know. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.